Okay, I'm just going to try and uh, make this 30 gram peg perform like this 100 gram peg. So I'm going to test a 100 gram peg first. Soft ground here in East Lanks in October, so straight in. All the way in. It's a comparative test, so we'll call it 25 past. Ooh. I'm going to test a uh, 30 gram peg with my 10 gram device, temp peg revolution as I call it. There's a guy slot at the top, there's a guy slot underneath. The guy rope goes round over the top and round the back. <clears throat> And the peg actually faces the opposite way a normal one would. It's all about the redirection of forces, that's how it works. Hit a rock, I think, there. So there we are. So 25 past to be from a much lighter peg. Oh, and there we go, it's all the way around to 25 too. I hope this isn't going to, I think I'll leave it there. Because I don't want that thing. So, much greater holding power uh, from a 40 gram unit compared to a 100 gram peg. Ideal for backpacking. Also, the peg doesn't rotate when you're pulling it out, like normal pegs do. And you can carry them like that on, the, on your backpack, or if you're going mountaineering or anything. Lighter, more powerful. Thank you.